It's a pleasure to be here. Uh, this uh, almost on daily basis in, in our relationships uh, with Russia Federation and now um Russia has committed itself to uphold democratic principles and to safeguard also basic freedoms and all the rights of its people but today uh, none of that appears to be uh, true let me quote I think a few examples that are certainly familiar uh, to you First of all, the rule of law in Russia is undermined by, by court decisions being subjected to political influence. We see also that the freedom of expression is challenged by self-censorship and journalists are silenced and have feeble legal recourse against uh, repressive measures. We see also a refusal to register opposition parties and that undermines, uh, naturally, the forthcoming state Duma uh, elections. And then, uh, finally, the March uh, 2012 presidential elections lack also democratic credibility. Uh, it seems that more and more it's a, a little game uh, between the actual president and uh, the uh, uh, prime minister and vice versa, so I'm not very sure how to describe it today. ...to you because your straightforward ideas and, and brave speech um, brings um, always people back on the ground. And on this part of our conference, then we will have a short moment also for the panelists. But please, uh, there are two questions. I have already registered two questions uh, from there, please. Olga Radeva, Yablaka. Uh, 